What the skibbity? The Cowboys will be without wide receiver Brandon Cooks for at least this week versus Pittsburgh and potentially longer after an infection developed in his right knee following a procedure he had after remaining in New York following the win against the Giants. Okay, I know what to do here. All right, so we got Travis Hunter at number one, Tedaroya McMillan at number two, Ashton Genty is ranked number three so far. Okay, so here's the big board right here, ladies and gentlemen. We know we're not in it for a quarterback, so we're going to need a skill position. We might as well start looking at the NFL draft, bro, because what in the skibbity is going on? What is happening, bro? What is happening? Why did y'all let Brandon Cook stay in dirty, dusty-ass New York City with all them big-ass rats running around using the surgical equipment and eating utensils for their cheeses and stuff in a damn big-ass New York sewer rat holes? Why y'all let this man get surgery done in New York of all places, man? You should have came back to the great state of Texas and got your surgery done out here in a clean, open unpolluted air bro <sighs> well wishes to brandon cooks i hope he has a speedy recovery but oh my this is this is not a, this is not a minor blow this is not a minor blow this is our second receiver on the depth chart and now we already had an office that was struggling. We already have an office that has no run game. But now Brandon Cooks is off the field, which means we're going to have to depend on Jalen Tolbert, Jalen Brooks. CD is going to have to go absolutely bat-ish insane. And I suspect we're going to see Pittsburgh seriously roll a bunch of double and maybe even triple coverages over to CD now, man, because it is news right here. I suspect we see CD locked up in that Pittsburgh game. He's going to have a lot of attention on him. They got to really, really get creative to get the ball in his hand. This is not, this is not what we needed to hear, especially given the situation and the circumstances that Dak and CD, these guys, they already doing a lot with a little on his offense. Now it's Ryan Flanoy's season. It's time to finally activate Ryan Flanoy and let that man play in a game. It's time. It's time for Ryan Flanoy to finally see the field. Maybe it's fans. This may be another one of those blessings in the sky. Who am I kidding, bro? This is too much. This is too much. No Deron Bland. No Michael Parsons. No Demarcus Lawrence. No run game. No Brandon Cooks. Our offensive line is hurt. Zach Martin is regressing. The rookies, the rookies really look like rookies, man. Ha. We need Devontae Adams, bruh. Look, look, I posted a message on my ex account earlier. I said, dear old ass Jerry and cheap ass Stephen Jones, y'all told us that you were all in to start the off season. That was a lie. You delayed moves to the point where improving the roster wasn't possible any longer. If any time were ever the time to make good on those bold claims, now, would be that moment. Get your old, crusty, wine and cheese eating asses off the damn helicopter into the star and make good on your damn all in bullshit, man. The defense is depleted and the offense is really lacking firepower. Now, go load the MF and clip, Jerry. You are 897 years old. You don't have long left. Signed, the DAC attack on behalf of Cowboys fans. Tired of your bullshit everywhere, man. Oh my goodness. This is ringing true ever so brilliantly right now. Is now we really need a receiver, y'all. We really need them to go get an Amari Cooper. We really need them to go get a Devontae Adams. Make the trade happen. I don't care what has to happen. 
make the trade happen. The Browns would probably take Trey Lance off of your hands for Amari Cooper. For one, they're a terrible organization that sucks at looking at quarterbacks anyway, so they would probably take a flyer on a Trey Lance. Two, Amari is dirt cheap right now. I wouldn't be surprised at all if that's a move that we could make like yesterday. Go get us a receiver, bruh. Wow. Wow. Brandon Cooks is out. Now, you know the Cowboys knew about this. Now it kind of making me believe a little bit that maybe they did inquire about Devontae Adams. Maybe they are monitoring that situation based on the situation with B. Cooks. This is... Stay locked in, ladies and gentlemen. The Cowboys season is getting very interesting very early on with a lot of drama. And, man, Dak Prescott, these guys, they have a lot to overcome. This is an interesting, interesting season. And right now, the story of the 2024 season seems to be injuries. It's the, it's the battle of attrition right now, ladies and gentlemen. But either way, we steal the same old cowboy. Calling me, texting me, paging me, asking me, am I still the ball? Y'all usually check on me. Listen, 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 listen. I'm still the boys. Hey, hey! Woo, hold on, my boy, Hey!